Hello everyone, hope you're doing great. My name is John and today I'm going to discuss about how to prepare hard drive for Windows 11. Let's first get to know a little bit about Windows 11. Windows 11 offers enhanced user experience with its exciting new and improved features. Go to their official website now to preview how amazing this new upgrade is. If your device meets the requirements, you can get a free upgrade as well. Coming back to the topic, for those who's trying to replace an old or small hard drive with a new one, or simply want to add an additional new hard drive to install Windows 11, this video guide would be really helpful. What's a hard drive? As you can see, this is the front and back. We install it directly to the disk controller of the computer's motherboard. It's a primary storage device for a computer system. It usually contains pre-installed software applications, the operating system, and other files. All hard drives are found inside a computer case and are attached to the computer motherboard using an ATA, SC, SI, or SATA cable. Hard drives are powered by a connection to the PSU, power supply unit. Connect the hard drive. Here, I've used SATA cable to install the new hard drive into the computer. Part 1. Locate the hard drive. Congratulations! Now you've successfully installed the new hard drive on your computer. A new hard drive usually does not show up in Explore. So, here is where you would locate the hard drive on your computer. Step 1. Go to Windows Disk Management to locate the drive. Step 2. Check the status of the new hard drive. Three statuses would be displayed in front of you. Unknown, not initialized, and unallocated. Step 3. You must configure the hard drive before Windows can use it. Here's how to do it. Firstly, initialize with a GPT disk style. Modern computers use GPT disk style and Windows 11 requires a GPT disk. Secondly, create a new drive on the unallocated space with the drive letter. The NTFS file system that is the Windows compatible file system and a volume label. Part 2. Use new hard drive for Windows 11. Once done, we'll move to what you can do with the new hard drive to install Windows 11. Here's your first option. Clean install Windows 11 on the new hard drive. Set the new hard drive as the boot drive. With the new hard drive correctly connected to your PC, you can now start migrating Windows 11 to the new disk. Firstly, download EaseUS Partition Master from the website's download center. Once downloaded and installed, use the Migrate OS feature to migrate Windows 11 to the new hard drive. Step 1. Click Migrate OS. Step 2. Select the new hard drive and click Next. Step 3. Click Continue and Proceed. Part 3. Booting Windows 11 on the new hard drive. Step 1. Press the required BIOS key to enter the BIOS setup utility. F2 and Delete are the default keys to enter BIOS. Step 2. In the boot menu, locate the new hard drive and set it as the boot drive. Step 3. Start the computer in to save the changes in BIOS settings and restart the computer. Part 4. What you can do with EaseUS Partition Master for better Windows 11 experience. For your convenience, EaseUS Partition Master is a superior partition tool designed for everyone to manage partitions in Windows without data loss. The tool can help you in basic operations like resizing, formatting, deleting, wiping and merging partitions. Windows 11 PC emphasizes the UEFI Secure Boot, and UEFI is based on GPT. You may need to convert the system disk from MBR to GPT to support Windows 11 install. So, here were some of the key steps you can take to prepare hard drive for Windows 11, brought to you by the EaseUS. Step 1. Locate and prepare the new hard drive. Step 2. Use new hard drive for Windows 11. Step 3. Boot Windows 11 from the new hard drive. Step 4. Optimize drive with EaseUS Partition Master for better Windows 11 experience. Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe EaseUS for new featured videos. 
I'm John. See you next time. Bye-bye.